So as you can probably expect, oh wait, is it loaded? It actually loaded! I've been sitting here for 10 minutes. I was about to say this has been delayed because I couldn't get in. That is probably because Barrow has just turned up and it was, I don't know, something to do with that. But if you are after his signal, that's Barrow's signal, you're first going to have to equip Anaurus. Same goes with the normal relay, but Barrow Katia has reappeared yet again for his Tenocon relay. This is not the Tenno Live relay, which will go live in... Oh, trying to quickly do math. Six hours? Just under now? That will come at... That, yeah, that will come at 5pm ET when Tenno Live starts. That is not due to be here yet. But seeing as this is a second chance to basically buy everything and anything that Barrow has ever brought. It's actually giving you a giant countdown as well to the Tenno Live 2020. Uh, this isn't the Tenno Live relay though. This is the Tenno... well... Technically it's probably exactly the same relay. We'll have to see how that works out when it comes, but Barrow is only accessible if you buy the digital ticket and he has brought everything. Is it still down there? Which includes, for the third time, because he brought it once, then he brought it last time he came for the, when Tenocon was supposed to happen, on the 11th of July, and he's brought it again for the 1st of August. This, this time, should be the last time he will ever bring that. Apart from the fact that if it's in his rotation, even if he brings it once, he should bring it with him next year. At... Tenocon 2021. It's this thing. The only way to get that, which allows you to do a mission with Barrow Katia with you, it's like a defense mission, is to have Anaurus equipped. I didn't mention this yesterday when his normal rotation happened because, well, I straight up forgot. But you can actually pick it up. These are tradable and there's that massive lag again. You can buy it once. Just once. Prime Chamber, however, you can buy that as many times as your Ducats will allow. It's 2,995 Ducats and a million credits. It's not cheap. But he has brought everything with him. And I mean absolutely everything he has ever sold before. That's a K-Drive scroll. Anything that he has sold in the past year. The mod chance booster is also here. That can be pretty useful. The resource boosters, credit boosters, affinity boosters, of course they are just 3D. The spectres, they're there. The tome scenes there, the extraction scenes there. All of the different armor sets are here. All of them. Absolutely everyone. One thing I am noticing though, his ephemera is here, but there's something missing. The Fear Path of Femuras here, um, for the record, that's not supposed to be there. That you got for enabling the two-factor, authentic, whatever it was called stuff. But it's Sparrow has it for some reason. He only brings that on console. He doesn't normally bring that on PC. But that snuck its way in here, so if you didn't enable that, you have a chance to actually pick that up. The Elixis Latron... Oma set is here. It was his new thing last time. Kind of already. Hang on, I own that. I thought I owned that. Apparently not. But it's absolutely everything he has ever brought. All the weapons, all the slash, the 120% slash mods, the dual status mods, and every single prime mod ever. All of them. Oh, it's just, you could spend so much here. But this, of course, initiates the start of Tenocon 2020, with it kicking off at 12.30 p.m. Eastern Time, with the whole live stream. Remembering if you link your Twitch and your Warframe account, you can start to claim your... I'm just going to say free items because you get the weapon for watching for 30 consecutive minutes. Of course, if this is how laggy the game is, maybe it's next to impossible to watch the stream for 30 whole minutes. 
And I was right, the Lotus Ephemera isn't actually here. He, so he has yet again not brought everything that he has actually brought in the past. Because right now, for his normal rotation over on the other relay on Earth, the Strata relay, um, yeah. If you want the Lotus Ephemera and you didn't get it last year, well, the only way to get it is to go see him on his normal relay and pick it up there. He hasn't brought that for the you have to pay to get a digital ticket to gain access to it. Tenocon relay. The normal Barrow has the Lotus Ephemera. The Tenocon one doesn't. But the Tenocon relay has absolutely everything else and I think I did pick up the signal from him yesterday and it is in fact the Tenocon relay not the Tenno Live relay so really interested on seeing how that happens at 5 p.m eastern time but for now we'll leave this off here thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time